Hi. It's been um, a month since I done my last video, which was um, True Blood, the complete second season on DVD, and also the True Blood drink as well. But now I am back. Um, sorry, I've done. I haven't done any videos because um, other things have been going on. Uh, I've been quite busy, and um, I recently had a holiday uh, within the United Kingdom. And um, there's a place called um, Park Dean Holidays, uh, Warm Well, down in Dorset. Here's the website here for you to take a look at. But today, on the DVD reviews, we're talking about um, Dead Like Me. The complete series one, the complete collection, the complete first season on DVD. But um, roll the titles and we'll be right back afterwards. Welcome back. Anyway, um, this show, uh, there have been two seasons of it, but um, all I've got is the um, current, the first season. Um, only la the, uh, the, the show actually lasted for, um, for two seasons, and then they made a movie called um, Dead Like Me um, After, no, Life After Life, I think, or something like that. Um, I don't even know if the the movie will be released in the UK, but um, I got to go. Of course, as they say, I got to get season two because I haven't got that one. And um, but this one is uh, quite good, and um, I think it's a very good show. And it's basically about a girl called Georgia Lass or George Lass, and um, she gets uh, killed by the um, by the uh, by a toilet seat. From the Maya uh, space station, and then after that, she becomes a Grim Reaper, and she meets the whole, the the rest of the Grim Reapers, and um, they take souls for a living, and they don't really get paid by doing it, so they got to like steal money and stuff. So, you know, it's um, quite a good show, I reckon. Um, I'll just show you the box set here quickly. That's you know that there, and. Uh, back of it. I'll read you the back of the cover and then I'll show you the individual cases. It says, the complete first season, 14 episodes on four discs. You're about to be collected, winningly, eccentric and instantly. Ever Everent, sorry, this groundbreaking original series delivers you into a realm of shockingly funny characters and twisted narratives. You'll find completely addictive. When an event toilet seat from the falling Maya space station puts an erupt end to her life, George, played by Ellen Muth, discovers that death is nothing like the, she thought it would be. Recruited to collect the souls of others as they die, she suddenly finds herself an unwilling participant in, an, in a line of work she never knew existed. Grim reaping. 
And it's, there's a whole lot of, uh, there's a buttload of extras on here, including audio commentary by the cast, deleted scenes, behind the scenes featurettes, the music of Dead Like Me, featuring executive producer John Masus and composer Stuart Copeland, and there's a photo gallery on there too. And I think it's a really good show. I um I've been meaning to get the second uh, show on DVD, but um I've been looking at for it to get it get quite cheap because it's not one of my favourite shows. I um you know I I bought it because I saw it on Sky One, and I thought it was a really good show then. Not as good as other shows I've got, but I thought I'll get the first season, and in time I'll get the second one. So I still haven't got it yet, but in time I'll still get that. Um, so let's have let's let's dive into the DVD set. It's like slip cases, little miniature slip cases like this. You know, little, little thin, thin cases like this. And uh, let's just take them all out now that I'll show you. I'll just put this um, on the floor a minute. Right. Um, actually, here we go. Um, let's start with. Dead Like Me Season 1 Volume 1 There's a front cover there Front cover on the back um, Of course you've got uh, On the first uh, disc you've got the pilot episode You've got episode 2 which is called Dead Girl Walking And you've got all the special features on this one um, There's the inside of the DVD there, case there And if you, um, yeah See it there DVD there and a little picture of Georgia Lass there with what looks like a post-it note which says isn't stealing from dead people kind of tacky and that was like a quote from the first season by Georgia Lass that was um, that's, uh, disc one and up to now disc two where it's got different artwork on each cover so there's disc two let me see if it's disc two correctly yeah disc two there's that one there. Looks like she's playing golf with the with the grim reaping scythe. Looks quite funny. And there's the back of the cover there. Let's just tell you what the episodes are on this one. Um, Curious George. Repercussions. Weeping havoc. My room. And that's um. One, two, three, four episodes on this one. And let's open it and let you see the disc. There you go there. Disc there. And there's another post-it note say uh, there, so I'll read that one. Uh, it says, No pulley gates for you. That's by the character of Rube, played by a man called um, Mandy Patakin. There's a little picture of him there. Yeah. Um... Right, and that's uh, disc two. Now we've got disc three, uh, which has the episodes Re Reaper Madness, uh, A Cook, uh, Sunday Mornings, and Business Unfinished. And that's another four episodes on disc three. Um, there's the back. Got like little nice bits, nice pictures inside there as well on each uh, each case. And there's the front of that one. Let's open up. Got the DVD there. Nice details on them, I reckon. And there you've got the character of Daisy, played by Laura Harris. And on that post-it note there it says it's weird though they always tell butter side down. Could we read that one where it was funny writing? Uh, but that's Daisy, as I say, played by Laura Harris. She was also very good in the movie um, The Faculty, which I've also got on DVD and I'll probably review it at, that at a later time. But anyway, that's um, disc three. And now to the final disc, which is disc four, because it's a four-disc set. Um, on here we've got 
The Bicycle Thief, Night Hawks, Vacation, and the final episode of season one, which is called Rest in Peace, which is the anniversary of George's death. 